and welcome back to another Apple's NTR's vlog. Today is going to be another classroom setup video, um, but we're starting out in the car because I have to go get one more storage load. One more. Um, a few weeks ago, I was in Queen Creek where I used to live and I had to pick up a bunch of stuff at my old neighbor's house. Um, because it wouldn't fit in the load when we came up that last time we moved up, like all this stuff. Um, and so there's like two huge boxes, my mini fridge, my microwave, and then two of those Ikea rolling carts. Um, and then I think there's one more thing there. But yesterday when I was unpacking all of the stuff onto tables, I was like, I'm missing this and I'm missing this and I'm missing that. And so I was like, oh, duh, like it's probably in storage. So anyway, I'm running to the storage unit right now to pick up all that stuff. It's 7.50 in the morning. And then I'm gonna go to the gym for like an hour. And then I'm gonna hit the classroom. We're gonna do this. Today, my goal is to get everything that gets put away, get it put away. Um, I'll probably leave all of the decor out because obviously I'm going to be decorating the room. Um, and I'm, I'm not going to do walls probably until next week. I would like to have the layout dialed in and everything put away and organized by the end of this week. So today's Thursday. I'm hoping by tomorrow, Friday, I can be completely done putting everything away and having things organized and kind of start getting like organization of like student things in place as well and like figuring out where I'm gonna be doing things. Like when I do stations, where are those gonna take place? Um, when I have kids like wanting to get up and move and sit places, where's that gonna be? Um, so I just really wanna have like everything kind of situated by Friday and then that way next week I can do walls and I can start planning prepping for the first couple weeks of school. I kind of want to do things a little bit like backwards because normally I would plan for like the first two days of school, but I feel like those first two days are like the easiest and, and because I'm new to the district and new to the school, I want to wait to plan and put a lot of time into my like first two days of school stuff because I feel like I'm gonna have like oh you need to make sure you you cover this with your classes and like I need to learn the procedures and routines of the school before I can like implement like sharing that with students you know what I mean so our first two days of school are a Thursday and a Friday um, and so I think I'm gonna plan for that first like full week so like that first Monday through Friday um, which will be, I believe like August 8th or something. I forget what that Monday is, but anyway, I'm going to wait to plan for that Thursday, Friday. Cause I already know like all the things I do for the first couple of days of school. I already know like my community builders and like how to teach my specific procedures and things like that. So I think I'm going to wait on those and just start planning like actual lesson stuff. Um, and then that way, like during like teacher meetings and stuff as I'm finding out information I can just kind of go plug those in um, because those first two days of school will move pretty quickly with all the organization and like throwing down school routines and like things like that do you guys catch my drift do you see where I'm going I just feel like if I go in and like make this beautiful presentation and like plan all of these activities and like things for the first two days of school and then I go sit in like my first school meeting and they're like oh you know, there's going to be an assembly at this time. You're going to need to do this at that time. Then all those plans I just made are like kind of out the window. So I'm going to start planning for the first actual full week of school, starting with like instructional stuff. Um, and I'm going to do all that next week because I want to be completely ready before I have to start going to like meetings and trainings because um, I'll probably have a full week of that um, prior to like meeting all of my new staff and coworkers and stuff like that. So anyway, <laughs> it's been a lot of talking already. Sorry, you guys, but I'm going to get all the stuff from storage, go to the gym, and then we'll get to the classroom and we'll get started. 
right, we are back in the classroom and we are getting started right away. I just unpacked those final two boxes and found a lot of what I was looking for yesterday. So that's good. Um, so now the plan is to just try to get everything that's on top of these tables organized and put away. That is my goal today. This table can be left alone because this is all decoration. Um, this is all organization. So this will be interesting. So right now what I'm working on is organizing um, like science supplies into cabinets and just kind of filling the cabinets. So I'm going through like, okay, what do I have space for? Okay, what can I put in here? Kind of situation. I'm just kind of like trying to sort out where I'm gonna store everything uh, that makes the most sense and so that I can find it very easily. Um, so that's what we're doing. Grab your snack because it's gonna be lots of music and enjoy.
All right, so it is now three o'clock. I've gotten a lot done and I know I haven't shown a ton of it on camera, but it's because with my ADHD brain, it was like one task, then another, then another, then another. So rather than walk, letting you guys watch me bounce around the room for however long, I'm just gonna show you what I accomplished today and let you know the plan for tomorrow. First of all, I have very cute helpers here. Helper one, helper two. Okay, we cleared one table, almost two, because all of that's kind of just snacks. So we, we cleared one table, we finished painting. So painting is done. I pulled these bins out today and I reorganized them. So now I have a little bit more space for storage. I think they're back, buddy. Scotty made back. glue sponges. Back, mm -hmm. I'm gonna put this by the sink. Scotty washed all my cabinets and then he painted these two. So we'll see. And then we moved this over here. I did all of the command hooks around the whiteboard so that tomorrow I can come back and hang the lights. That will need time to like get their sticky on. Yeah, this is like all of our junk. And then what else? I put these in here. Legos, this is games over here. And then I organized under the sink was like super dirty. I got first aid drawer set. And then this is more storage. And then I organized this upper cabinet. What else? Cleared that off. Um, I organized my library, which I think I have this piece that came off. And if I don't, I have half a mind to just like rip one off the other side and just glue it there. <laughs> this is my little library corner. Turned out kind of cute. Yeah, see that one's coming off in the back. I'll just rip it off and put it on the front. Um, and then I've got a little bench space. Decided to go ahead and use this for book storage. And then that way I could put my rotating book thing on the top. Um, I ended up putting this table over here. This is probably gonna be just like a station place and then a crafting space for me. So like next week when I start doing walls, I'll use this area for the Cricut. Um, and then this is like stuff I need to like organize. Um, I got my desk kind of situated. I decided to put these in here cause this is all the stuff that's like mine. Um, so I'll probably make new labels and then I put all that out. Um, got this all situated. And then Scott hung all of my clouds. There's only one that's not gonna have one, which sucks, but it's all right. Um, what else did I do today? Just a lot of like putting things away. There's still a lot to put away. Mom, yeah. Look what he let me have. <gasps> Ready? Let me see. You push this thing? Oh, that's fun. Watch. Whoa. That's cool. He let me keep it forever. That is so nice of him. Yeah. So, yeah. I'm ready to go. That's the end of day, what, two this week? I'm going to come in tomorrow and hopefully do some more organizing and hopefully clear off the other three tables because the paint here will be dry and I can start putting things up there. I think what I'm gonna do with that countertop is do like notebook storage with book bins um, or possibly binder storage because I know we're doing like binders. It's either gonna be in there or I don't know, probably over there because I have these book bins and I have these big ones. Don't know yet if I'm gonna do color-coded book bins 
Depends on what my teammates are doing. But either way, I think I'm gonna store all of those on this counter because there are no outlets over here. So I'm thinking if I store like student supplies over here and like paper flow, um, then I'm not gonna put any like lamps or anything that plugs in over here. I'll just probably put some like motivational posters in there. I don't know, we'll see. Maybe I'll make like a backsplash. I don't know, we'll see. But yeah, it's looking good. Almost done. That is the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to follow me on all the social media, Instagram, TikTok, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye.